All right, uh, welcome, uh, welcome for tonight's uh, Overwatch Overwatch game here with the Maricopa Esports League. Tonight we have Chandler Gilbert D1 versus Paradise Valley. Uh, I'm I'm Ryan, and we've got Alex. All right, we've got a couple seconds here before we're gonna get to see these hero selections. And we'll get the comments on that once we see it here in five seconds. All right, here come the team compositions. Ooh, Whirly, Whirly on the Sigma. I already like what I'm seeing here. Whirly Sigma was just after my stigma. Let's see what we'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll see what we get off of him this time around. Calder on the Zenyatta swapping over from DPS. That's a that's definitely a new change. And I see they're bringing out the mate. I was them quite oil last time around that I remember. A change to Brick uh, instead of his end. Oh, the, the quick swap right there. Rolling out on the Bastion Soldier. Ooh, the Soldier ditto, though. I'm, I'm, I'm excited to see how that one goes down. They're both going the same way. They both got Mercy Pockets. How's this going to unfold here? All right, Paradise Valley's taking point. But they, but uh, Chandler's got high ground. Points just about to unlock here in a second. And now, hopefully, we'll see some actual brawling because these teams are just <laughs> chilling behind cover. They're they're waiting for each other to make the first move, and there it is. Single jumps onto the point. Calder gets eliminated immediately. There comes the res right through. Oh, the diva gets eliminated. That's a second one for Pringle. Ooh, all right. CJC the point. <laughs> you take point, and they push back Paradise Valley. May gets cut out by herself. Not what you like to see there. Oof, they're all halfway to their ultimates. Valkyrie's coming up a lot sooner though. A swap onto the Ana. You saw the brick definitely didn't work out there. And oof, um, so uh, Pringles over here, Ab just completely diffed the other soldier. All right, Paradise Valley goes for attempt number two. Orisa's already getting low. The shield's out. She can't be healed through it. Mm, sleep has no effect. They drop Blizzard immediately, and it catches out one. We got ultimate domino that's here. The second one. Oh yeah, that that's a couple ultimates down. There goes window. But that looks like that's all they're gonna invest on this on each side. One ultimate each. Not not a very ideal window. Not a lot of value out of that one. Could have saved it. And they're gonna get a nice stagger on the soggy there. That's a flip point. Only 52% capture percentage, so they're in a good they're sitting pretty right now. Chandler Gilbert's already approaching for their second attack. They're getting ready to rumble here. Caffeine's really aggressive on this bad piece. He's always looking to output damage here. Or at least on the point, try to contest something. He's getting burned, but he's got he's still got his abilities up. He's pushing him off the point. Paradise Valley just completely gets off the point with no resistance. And Calder drops again. No ults used. Ooh, no ults, no nothing. Just Whirly walking forward. Holding W, apparently a valid strat here. <laughs> Paradise Valley's back on the, is once again on the back foot. They're gonna have to push in at some point because uh, Chandler Gilbert is creeping up on 75%. Blizzard is up again. Is it gonna get used the same as last time? Or are we gonna shoot some big plays? Oh, looks like we're not. That's a two piece. <laughs> Make that three for Chandler Gilbert. 87% here. We're uh, creeping up on 90. It's do or die here for round one. Out pops the visor with no one around. A little bit of a waste, a little bit of cocky, but it doesn't look, it looks like it's not gonna matter. The flux comes through and it doesn't look like anyone will make it to point. Valkyrie can touch, however. Valkyrie oh, and Marisa. Yeah, no, uh, that, that's not what you like to see. They're gonna keep it alive for now, momentarily. The Nano Mercy? And everything. They're gonna fight tooth and nail. They're gonna fight to the last man and they can't do it. Swift round there. Um, not what we expected to see. Not what I expected to see from from Paradise Valley. There, they just kind of 
They just kind of walked off the point. Ooh, stick. Stick with the BM immediately. <laughs> immediately with the L. Unsportsmanlike almost. Come on now, we're better than that. Alright. We've got some technical difficulties here. <laughs> uh oh, come on. Turning off text chat, okay. All right, comps stay the same. They pull out an Alari and a Stigma of their own. Other than that, we've got the same across the board here. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. We'll see how we'll see how the new comp changes unfold here for Paradise Valley. Let's see if they can adapt to this um, to this team here. After all, they put on quite a dominant display just a couple moments ago. Immediately going up for high ground. Ooh, soldiers already down. Make that Alari too. Once again, Paradise Valley on the back foot. Unfortunately, it's always it's always a domino effect. It's always one person, and then they just can't do anything about it. The Maywall comes up. Really good protection. These Maywalls have been really good defensive wise, but we haven't seen any anything aggressive for them. I'd like to see. Maybe maybe someone out of position get walled off. But to be fair, Taylor Gilbert's playing really goofed up here. They're not letting anyone get caught out by surprise like that. Here comes attack here comes push number two. Pylons down. They're gonna go away from it here. They got Bastion and Baptiste on this high ground here. Ooh. That was almost a kill, but he's still up. Oh, they're bringing people down. Oh, and there he goes again, the soldier. The throw is off. Out, but the Alari goes down already. Like, and what? And there's the soldier again. <laughs> one by one, man. I'm telling you. It. Chandler Gilbert's doing really good at oh. finding that opening pick. Looks like uh oh, problem. That, that looks. That might be a technical issue there that might need to get resolved. Are we gonna get a pause here, maybe? Yes, it is. Oh, there it is. Oof. That was um, Chandler Gilbert doing an excellent job finding that open pick in each and every fight. Paradise Valley really needs to try and uh, be the aggressors for a change. They need to, uh, as the attacking team, they need to decide when the fight is gonna take place. And they need to they, they need to make that decision and make it start it off with a bang, to say the least. They need to get a pick off the rip, the way Chandler Gilbert's been doing it, because they continue to do it, and it keeps Paradise Valley on the back foot there. Good choice. And the game begins right. again. Visor is up. So is Flux. No alts on the side of Paradise Valley. A Zenyatta switch. That's what we like to see. Blizzard is finally up. We'll see if we can get another really good usage of that like we saw in the last round. Ooh, that's four ultimates up on Chandler Gilbert, though. With the D.Va switch from Sigma. Yes, we got a D.Va switch here. Not very good for their alt economy. Out comes the window. The D.Max almost through. Ooh. I think they popped Valkyrie as well. Both support ultimates down. Bastion artillery is up to keep them off, but that's 95% and... They're practically all dead. That's going to be a 2-0 for Chandler Gilbert there for round one. That that was that was a very good showcase right there from <clears throat> from Chandler Gilbert, especially Worley as he gets play of the game here. Um, yeah, uh, walking towards the enemy team apparently was the way to go. <laughs> He only needs one button on his keyboard. W. Appar apparently, yeah. All right, let's see what we get coming into round two here with um, Paradise Valley's pick for the next. Oh, it.
We'll be right back.
All right, welcome, welcome back. back. We're here for game two of our set for Paradise Valley versus Chandler Gilbert. We're here on King's Row. Um, Chandler Gilbert will be attacking first, and in about 15 seconds here, we'll get to see the hero compositions. But let's talk about a little bit about last game. Um, what, what are we hoping to see here from Paradise Valley? Hopefully, a little bit more of a fight. Less yeah, of a steamroll. Let's see, let's, yeah, let's see these... Let's see these claws that we saw last time I was here. Um, Paradise Valley had some flashes of really great gameplay. Let's see them bring. I want. I want to see them bring it out. I want to see this one go the distance. I want this one to be a nail biter. <laughs> <laughs> All right, they're setting up their defense. We've got a Reinhardt. I love the Rhine pick. We always. We always. You always gotta appreciate the Reinhardt pick, no matter no matter who's on it. A Ryan versus Orisa. Ooh, that is not going to be fun for the Reinhardt. <laughs> but you know what? Maybe it will be. Maybe it'll just end up being another skill issue, and this Reinhardt's just going to say, "You know what? I don't care that I'm at a disadvantage. I'm going to win anyways." It's a different game. This time. We gotta love. We gotta love Heck on the Lucio. That is right. This is not Whirly here. I don't know. I don't know this person in particular. So we'll have to see how they play. Huh. Immediately going on the point. Fortify's already out. Amp has been used. <laughs> They're throwing everything in the kitchen sink right off the rip. Hanzo on the side. Oh, headshot. Ooh, Too late on the res. Nice blue, but oh my god. Absolutely obliterated. Calder makes sure to get one before he leaves. They can't kill him. Ooh. We might kill oh. somebody. He's, he is, he is making it as difficult as possible, and he finally goes down. He was doing everything in his power to make sure to be an absolute nuisance. That could have that that could have flipped the fight. Yeah. I honestly I would not have been surprised if Calder just went absolutely crazy and got a five man there. All right, we're setting up for a second defense here. Um, all right, they're they're pulling out their own bastion. Oh, already low. The Suzu looked like it got used, but apparently not. Yeah. All right, they're pulling up on the second point here. They're taking a good, they're taking a good offensive position. Chandler Gilbert. Um, ooh, Azaria swap. I I didn't even notice that. Ooh, Dragon is up. We got we got Calder versus Pringle again. Oh, and Calder's down. Unfortunate. That's gonna give, that's gonna give time. Gilbert a lot of a lot of free range here with Calder down. Calder Calder seemingly the best player on that team. Um, hopefully, oh, out comes the the window, and they're gonna get pushed back to second point here almost. No one was on the payload there for a little bit though, so a little bit of waste of time. But that doesn't look like it's gonna matter with how they've got Paradise Valley pushed back so far. I go back to Mercy. Oh, down again. That is not what we like to see. Calder's getting picked off time and time again. We definitely want to see more value coming from this Genji. Nano is up, so is Kitsune Rush. That's it for the side. That's it on Paradise Valley side. Chandler Gilbert coming up on two other ultimates on top of already having dragons. Graviton Surge is up. Wow, that got charged quickly. It was at 60%, now it's charged. Oh! I wonder if we're gonna see a surge. Here in the middle of the air. That's immortality down. That's a big one. Oh, she gets slipped. Does she die for it though? No, she does not. Calder goes down instead somehow. In the midst of it all, the dragons come out. And that's a triple dragon. Four makes the Zarya taking down the Orisa. That was a really good ultimate. That was a great ultimate by Pringle. All right, Blade is up. Nano is down. They do have Orisa ultimate. They're coming in for the final defense. They're making their last stand. Fashion's already down. Asleep going to the wayside. Calder looks like he's gonna die too. And there he goes. The both DPS are down. The tank doing everything they can, but they just can't hold it up. Ooh, and they'll fall one by one, and that will be the end of the attacking round. Another steamroll. Another one, unfortunately. Oh. That that was that 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 was just the consequences of momentum. That's how it is on high. Yeah. Games. 
you pick up that momentum and you, and the other team can't break it it'll lead to an, it's just gonna snowball and you just it, it'll it'll turn into an easy win in the matter of seconds calder unfortunately getting caught out a lot here in round two um hopefully we see a little bit less of that uh coming into their attacking round let's see some fireworks let's see what we saw at the beginning of the round that's what i want to see I want to see Calder putting up an absolute fight against this. I want I want Paradise Valley to be putting up an amazing... I want them to put up a star-studded fight here. I want them to go all out. Because right now, if if Chandler Gilbert wins... Uh, if Chandler Gilbert stops them from making it all the way, they will win this game. So it's now or never coming in to these fine, final 20 seconds before this match starts. It's now or never for Paradise Valley, and I want to see them go all out here. Let's just hope they don't run out of gas. <laughs> we got the D.Va switch. Oh, we do, we do. Um, oh, and Ramatra on the other side. I don't really know who's got the advantage there. I'm not too familiar with either of the two tanks, but we're going to see who establishes the... <laughs> We're gonna see who establishes this um, advantage here at the start of the fight. We do have the May again, although it isn't, um, although it's not the same May as it was last round. Let's still see if they can make it just as effective. Diva already de mm, That's not what you like to see. But Chandler Ooh. Gilbert is doing a great job. Ooh, down goes the fashion. That's crazy. That's really good. There goes the immortality. Out comes the res though from Echo. Really good, really good res there to push to, to keep things a little bit more evened out. But no mortality field means they have a lot more free reign. Ramacho by himself a little bit. He's perfectly fine. Good, that was the Maya. Ash! Just dink and dink. And there goes May. And there goes another D mech onto the Diva, and she will actually die this time. Oh! And that's a double for caffeine. This Baptiste is out here. This Baptiste is taking zero prisoners. <laughs> that's what we like to see from the support. We like to see them get some action every now and then. And not just healers. Ash watching these yeah, Ash watching these sightlines. She's ready for anyone to come out of the woodwork here. Calder tossing his shurikens, trying to do anything, but it's not doing much. The diva getting pressured. Anna doing her best in the back line to support her team. The May pushes forward a little bit without their tank. The tank goes to the high ground to contest the Ash. Ramatra is trying to push around here. Oh, out comes the ice block, and she's out, and she's gone, just like that. And there goes Anna. Out comes the Res. Oh, but unfortunately, it's gonna cost Anxiety her life, and. Anna will die a second time. <laughs> she will come back to life and she will fall once again. Diva is not getting out. Out comes the Ramatra ultimate. Overkill. Oh, never mind. That wasn't his ultimate. That was Nemesis for him. I'm stupid. <laughs> My bad. Uh, immortality field. Uh, interesting call, but that was Calder. So to be fair, he could have killed the kill as we saw last time. Out comes a Zenyatta pick. This is what we like to see. We want to see some good value here from these Discord orbs. Although significantly less healing, we got to make sure that everyone stays healthy. And that's what's been the problem for this team. They keep getting picked. Ooh, look at that. Diva already almost de mech She's going to get behind cover and she'll be perfectly fine. Bob is ready. Uh, Ramatra all and Pushinal already, so is Valkyrie, and no alts on the side of Paradise Valley. They keep swapping off their characters. Diva Bob is coming up in a little bit here. Blizzard has been just about fully built. Oh, there comes the Ramatra ultimate. That's a D-Mech under the Diva. It's doing lots of damage. The wall is good, but not good enough, it seems. It saved the Diva. Anything here, but it looks like he's not going to be able to do much. And that's... Ooh. The bomb, or uh, the bomb, I guess, did come out, and so did the remake. It doesn't get much value, though. Unfortunate. They do have Blizzard and Dragons, but on the other side, we have Window and we have Bob. 25 seconds left on the clock here for Paradise Valley. Do or die time. I 
Nano is up. We can see, we, we want maybe a transcendence. Out come the dragons, out comes the window. Ooh. Oh, they might turn it around. It's two for two right now. They need to do something here with three seconds. They need to stay on point. Out comes the Nano fighting for their lives on the point here. And Ana's gonna get absolutely jumped and she's gonna go down. They still have, they still have Bomb. Bomb can, Bomb can still win this. They're still one on point. They can't get off the point. Overtime picks down a little bit. They're still safe here. Oh, the Mako's back. They might have this one. Immortality feels a little bit too late. Out comes the flow. They're stabilizing here. They're stabilizing. They're cooking with gasoline. We're seeing them go the distance and they'll capture the point. Now that safety can keep this up. Oh, Calder already taking out Pringle. That's what we like to see. That's what we wanted to see. That's what we've been waiting for. That's a good wall. That's a good, that's an even better res there. Zenyatta prepping the volume. Not much value, but that's fine. He's got basically infinite of those orbs. Whew. That's what we like to see. They turned on the jets and they did it. They, they got the point. Now they just got to do that two more times here. Let's see if they can keep this momentum. Here. Transcendence is up, so is Bomb. They've got Valkyrie, and they still have Bob. Out comes the Bomb, gonna get caught by the wall. Down goes the Diva. Only the immortality field, unfortunate. No alts in response to the Bomb. That that was that's a really good response by Chandler Gilbert, not needing to use any ultimates to counter the Diva Bomb. And they're gonna take a defense. They're gonna take the offensive here, and they're gonna push forward. Zenyatta might get caught out here. No, he uses Transcendent. He's going to be safe for now, but we'll see what Window happens. goes out. Oh, out. Window goes out. A lot of ults are coming out. There comes the res, too. Valkyrie is out. Hansa going for the high ground. Chandler Gilbert's doing whatever they can to keep this point from getting taken. We need to see we need to see another great play like we did just now. We're coming up to the one minute mark. Paradise Valley needs to do it. They've done it before, they need to do it again. We need to get they need to get this one done and dusted with over here. Evo's on the point. That's the barrier down. They're not gonna have to worry about that. The match is essentially out of abilities. The nano's Much. out! The Diva shredding! Down goes the Ramatra! The Diva's gonna push forward, that's a double! No immortality either. They're going to have to get pushed back here. That's going to be a lot of space made up. They're going to need it because they've got 25 seconds left to make it the distance. They do have Blizzard to keep them off the payload, but they're going to need to keep them off and they're going to need to stay on here. We're approaching overtime in 15 seconds. Chandler Gilbert's going to try to go fast and loose with this one. They're going to try to hit him as hard as they can. That's why they've got the Zarya. Already at 33% all charge. Oh, the Bastion's going to be safer now. Out comes the Blizzard. And it's down. Diva's in there. No immortality field, but she gets d max. Oh, and they're going to pick up quite a few kills. Can they stabilize here? And that's going to be a team kill. Unfortunate. A swift team kill. To send it off with CGC winning this one, two nothing. They put up a better fight this time. They put up a much better fight this time. That's what we wanted to see. But that'll be it for tonight. We'll see you next time.